Australia has rolled out its first squad of the summer. Team huddle. We're back in the changing. Yeah. <laughs> but one player who won't be there for the Trans-Tasman T20 series is spinner Jess Jonathan after injuring her knee this week on the Gold Coast. Like we, we won't know till probably Friday morning where she's at, but best case scenario, we're looking at hopefully the, the back end of the Malaysia tour for her to join the squad. The nucleus of the 13-player squad remains the same from the Southern Stars' last outing on the subcontinent. To be honest, the, the first 11 were pretty pretty much picked themselves. We were in good form in, in India, so we're pretty confident that that formula works. Um, but then the makeup of the rest of the squad was, was up for grabs. Making the most of that opportunity are two new faces from the Melbourne Renegades. Georgia Wareham bolsters the spin stocks, while fast bowler Taylor Vlamink also got the nod. Both Taylor and Georgia have um, come through the NPS program over the winter under Leah Poulton and, and I'm really confident that that's prepared them very well to come into to our, our side and um, our makeup and, and really contribute. Australia will be desperate to atone for their 2-1 home defeat to New Zealand the last time the White Ferns toured, with even bigger things to come. New Zealand will provide us with you know, great competition. Um, they're a really good side who have been playing good T20 cricket over the last few years. So I think it's the perfect test for us heading into the T20 World Cup and we're all looking forward to it. All eyes will be on the Seven Network, Fox Sports Cricket and Cricket.com.au when the series kicks off at North Sydney Oval on September 29.